Hey guys, Kills for Frills here, and we're back again with some more Project Zomboid, where we follow Dixon Nass with his journey through the zombie apocalypse. So Dixon Nass has schizophrenia. We are using the schizophrenia mod. If you'd like to know what that is, the link is in the description. You can feel free to head over, click it, and read what it adds. It basically adds a hell of a lot of stuff to the game. It freaks you out a bit. It makes you paranoid. You see zombies. You All sorts of stuff. All sorts of stuff. It is a bit of a carnage mod, to be honest. It's a bit mental. Um... So, we have walked from Riverside to the checkpoint outskirts of Louisville, because why the hell not, all the way from there to here. Now, we are what well, I can only put down as military housing. We're in the military housing. Our house is over here. As you can see, we've looted the crap out of this town there. I have an idea. I have an idea. I decided to take up some weapons and uh, murder loads of zombies. We've killed six, uh, 965, which is good. I think it's the most zombies I've killed so far. Uh, his aiming's getting better and his reloading's getting much better. So I'm thinking that we've got a lot of guns. We've got a lot of ammo. I've got a plan. I, I have got a plan for the zombie purge. And I know what we can do to clear out the front of the base. And this is going to be amazing going to be a bit carnage but it's going to be amazing. What I'm going to do is I'm going to round up everything I can from this area here, and I'm going to walk home. Yeah, it's going to take ages, but I'm going to do it anyway. We've got time. We've got food. We're all right. And then once I'm there, I'll, uh, I'll slowly let you guys into the plan. I have such an amazing idea. It's going to work, or it's going to go wrong on a mega scale uh, and probably end our lives. But, you know, it's worth it, right? Why not? Ha! Let's do this. All right, we made it back to camp. Wasn't too bad, I suppose. Dropped all my gear off. Right. So, in order for this plan to work, I am going to have to probably block off this entrance completely so they don't get in. Because I know they can get through kind of like this area here with the doors and they can smash through this gate. So, I want to completely block this off just so I don't get snuck up on. Because I know I'm aware there's a load of zombies on the other side of this fence. I mean, you can only see a few, but there is quite a lot out there. And then, I need to start to work on the other side. So, I'm going to have to go around the camp. Now, it's going to take a bit of time. It's probably going to take me a couple of hours to set this up. Obviously, I'm not going to record it because... Well, I mean, you don't want to sit there watching me for, like, two hours dismantling stuff, do you? Because, Jesus Christ, he's thirsty already. Because, you know, it's, it's a waste of time, right? It's a bit boring. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to start dismantling everything I can that's wood in this camp. And I'm going to rip up, cut down all these trees. I'm going to do everything I can get. I'm going to get everything. I'm going to set it up so it looks nice. And then the other side, well, you'll have to wait to see what I do with this side. But it's going to it's gonna look good. If it works, it's going to be amazing. If it doesn't, and then we, yeah, we're gonna probably going to go to die. And we'll have to get out of there quick. So I'm going to have to set up some sort of bug out bag to make sure we're going to be all right. But I've got a plan. I have a great plan. It's going to be amazing. Woo! That was a mission. So, we are sorted. I have got all my gear ready. Uh, I've got my weapons. I've got all of my stuff on me that I need on me. I haven't put on me my... Uh... That's how long it's taken. They're turning into bloody skeletons and disappearing. Jesus Christ. I haven't got my armor on. Actually, where is my armor? I'm pretty sure it's in one of these, isn't it? Oh, no. Please don't tell me I've dumped the armor somewhere. Oh, no. I've dumped my bulletproof armor somewhere. Oh. Well, it don't matter. I wasn't really... I mean, I liked it and all, but... It wasn't amazing. I'll find it. Okay, it turns out I had it on me the whole time. I'm just blind, apparently. So, we have been busy. Um, I have basically don't have a weapon in my hand. Let's uh, let's put that on. Let's get that bad boy out straight away. So, I have basically dismantled almost everything in this army camp. Uh, and I built a little barrier system down there so they can't get in. So, they can't sneak up on me. Uh, some of you might know where this is going. So if you don't, you will in a minute. I'll show you when we get there. Here we are. This is the spot. This is what I was trying to show. 
that is just ammo parts and bits and pieces for guns. I've got all my nails and stuff and whatever else I dismantled over there. That's just leftovers. I don't need that. In here, we have magazines. In here, we have guns. In here, we have more guns. And in here, we have a crap load of ammunition. Like, uh, a lot of ammo. So, we have this and a nice little area here. So, my plan is to go out there, green my head off, pull all the zombies I can get into here, and then shoot them all. How good is that? You can get through this pretty much without hurting yourself, but the zombies can't. Uh, he's a bit of an idiot sometimes and falls over, but he doesn't actually take any damage, so it's absolutely fine. I was going to say, how can I hold 18 out of 28? So he's absolutely fine. He can make it through it absolutely fine. Turns out the cot beds give wood and nails, and I just cut down a few trees for some more wood, and we built that. So this is it. This is what we're going to do. We're going to head out into the trees. I'm just going to leave that open. I, I'm not going to shut it. I want them to come through. And I'm going to call the zombies. And I'm going to round them all up. And we're going to walk back down to the base. And then we're going to get a shotgun. And some shotgun shells. And murder them all. I'll come back when I've got all the zombies. Well, holy crap. Oh, God, there's loads. <laughs> this is going to be amazing. I'm not going to lie. This is making me a little bit nervous. Just a tad. To be honest, I thought there was going to be a lot more zombies than this. But I'm probably going to walk to the end of the road, turn back around and then walk back to the base slowly. Just rounded them all up as I go. The more zombies I get, the better. And the more fun it will be, I know that. This is going to be amazing. Come on, guys. Let's do this. <laughs> There's loads of them behind me. <laughs> oh, I'm bloody crazy. This is what happens when you've lasted over a month and you start feeling safe. You start doing ridiculously stupid things. Tell what, we'll go this way. Come on. Round up. Round up. Come up. Come, boy. Come up. There's a good zombie hordes. There's good zombie hordes. Well, I'd say that's a pretty fair-sized horde. I mean, it's no West Point horde that's behind me, but I would say that's a pretty fair size. Wouldn't you? There's quite a few zombies there. And there's still more coming, which is nice. Yo, guys, where are you going? You're going the wrong way. Steer off to your left, guys. Come on. I'm taking you back round to the road. Come on. There we go. We don't want to waste our time here. Come on. Also, I forgot to mention that I almost got murdered. When I was clearing out the base, not the base, but when I was gathering all the wood, I didn't realise there was two zombies hiding in one of the portal toilets. I took the door off and one of them lunged at me. I'd done them though. I'd done them both. But, oh my God. But yeah, no, it was a close one. It was a stupid thing. I, I was reckless a little bit. Can you imagine that? Getting killed by a portal who bloody zombie would have been sucked personally i just hope that barrier holds um i didn't test it against a horde i tested it against a couple of zombies like at the bottom part but i didn't test it against the horde um <laughs> if it doesn't hold then we can always bolt out the side exit we've got some food on us we've got some medicine and stuff like that and water so we should be good to go if, if it fails we'll be all right I feel like I'm leaving some of them behind. I'm going to have to go back, I reckon. Go get some more. Here they come. They're coming through. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Please make me get through this fence before they get to me. Please don't attack the fence. Oh, God. They're really close. They're not really close, but come on. Get through. Don't be an idiot. Just get through. Done. I'm through. They shouldn't be able to get through that now. No, they just stand there. <laughs> Oh, yes. I should have got the guns ready, but I didn't. Right, let's get that out. And I feel like we're going to need some shotgun shells. Uh, Where are they? There we go. We've got 40 there. That would do us for now. Uh, we do have more. Ah, oh, this is amazing. Right, here we go. Let's load that. Hello, guys. Welcome to the uh, zombie horde killing zone, actually. This is the zombie horde. This is the killing zone. And here we go. Aim and fire. And fire. <laughs> oh, what did I make? 
<laughs> oh, this is amazing. Oh. oh, I should have looked at my zombie kills. We're at 989 now. I think we we're at 970 odd. So I've killed about 10 already. Oh, I ran out of ammo. Let's reload that. Ah, oh, this is going to be nice. Can I call them still? Are they going to come if I call them? I should get to the stragglers should come in because they can hear it. But that's why I blocked off the bottom part. Because I didn't want any zombies coming from the bottom, you know? Got a nice little crossfire area going on as well. As long as I'm not stupid and don't jump over the barrier, I should be alright. I don't want to waste my shotty on uh, single targets. Is that it? Is that how many old... Old six rounds? Come on. There we go. Ah, this is so good. I can't get those scumbags there, though. They're going to be an issue. I'm getting another gun out on them. Tell you what, let's get another gun out on them. Reload this one. We'll sort out another gun. I've got other guns. I've got some rifles and stuff. Here we go. We've got a new rifle. Hello, guys. I mean, this is going to take some time, but at least I can shoot them from down here, you know? I've got the range. Oh, wow. This is going to be a while, I think. Oh, my God. Yeah, okay. My aiming sucks. Come on, mate. You haven't hit anything. Uh, I could probably put a scope on it. Does the scope help? Would that help with the aiming? Oh my days. What is his skill in this? What is his skills? I mean, the aiming's gone up, so... And the reloading's gone up. So I should be... Come on. Got it. Go. Oh, nice. That's one aiming. There we go. Level two aiming. Still missed. Damn it. Oh, can only hold... This, we're going to be here sometime, but we are going to clear them out, I promise. One thing's for sure is we're not going to run out of ammo. I've got 18 boxes of 308s. And I've got another 7 boxes of 308s in there. So we are not going to run out of ammo. we got enough to last us some time, I think. Let's open all, to, all of them. There we go. Jesus Christ. that do. 200 rounds. Nice. Right. Uh... Let's get the gun back out, I suppose, and just carry on shooting. This is weird. There's a zombie inside the compound. I don't know if she's a reanimated or fake. Ah, oh, god damn it. She was a fake one. I knew it. I knew it. Alright, get back to those zombies on the border. Oh, it's going to take forever with that gun. It only holds, like, three bullets at a time so I'm, I'm about done with that i've had enough uh i need to find something else the m14 that looks good have i got any m14 magazines i should have yeah, i've got eight of them yeah let's grab an m14 mag and let's grab an m14 i've got four of them bad boys let's go for the one with the best condition that one and let's go on from there what rounds does that take the 308 as well nice we've got loads of that Although he is quite hungry, I might give him some mac and cheese. Just eat all the mac and cheese. That would be nice. There you go, mate. Eat all that. Get yourself nice and fat. Nice and full. Still losing weight, but we don't care at the moment. we got better things to do. All right, reload murder zombies. Here we go. Ah, oh, much better. Ah, oh, much better. This will be faster. Nope. Missed. There we go. It's got some range on it as well. Missed. Oh. Come on. Take it down. Take our time to aim and fire. Miss. Aim and fire. Nailed it. Now, this is good. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I told you this would be a great idea, didn't I? I said it was going to be amazing. The zombie purge. Ah, zombie massacre. Look at the state of it. Why can't I hit this one? Damn it. Come to get a better angle. Ah, I missed. Come on. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's quite hard shooting for a fence made out of uh, metal like this, but come on. There it is. 
I should have just gone out there with my shotgun and started nailing them, but I didn't want them to like sneak up behind me. At least this place is kind of like safe, you know? That's the same one I can't shoot. Is she even real? I don't know. Try this bird over here. Come on, mate. Oh, glancing blow. Come on, shoot her. There it is. I want this one dead, though. Got it. Ha. Oh, he's putting more down. Oh, reload. Right, the first wave is pretty much gone. There's a few down here, a few stragglers. I'm going to head around this side and see if I can get them. If I can't get them, then I'm probably screwed. I should be able to get them from this angle. I still can't even get them from this angle. These two top ones I can. Oh, I can. Nice. That's why I built it in here, so I've got some crossfire gunner. Like, even if I couldn't reach them, I could get them from this side anyway. So it doesn't really matter. As long as I can get them, it'll be all right. There we go. There we go. <laughs> They're all dead. <laughs> this is amazing. This is amazing. All right, let's check my score of zombies. I've killed 1,036 zombies now. Holy crap, that is a lot. Right, I'm going to lob this gun on the floor because I don't want to take it with me. I'm going to pop the magazine on the floor and I'm going to lob the 308s on the floor as well. Uh, and I'm going to hop back over that fence, but I feel like I might take a shotty with me just in case, you know. In case I want to murder some whilst I'm over there. And look at this mess. Look at all these bodies. Like, there's loot everywhere. Like, look at it. <laughs> well, it worked. Worked better than I expected. There's a few stragglers out there, I think. I would probably melee these to death. I'll go and get the proper ones in a bit, I reckon. Let's just murder these quick. We'll use my little axe. This me little... My little... Catch it. There's not too many of them. There's only a few. Come on, guys. Don't really want to... There it is. I knew you were going to come and get me. Ran around at quick there, didn't you? Didn't take you long enough to spin around and have a go at me. Right. What we got? We got a few stragglers. We're going to go back into town. Not town. We'll the road. And put as many as we can back again. And murder some more. Well, I mean, this little camp area looks like an absolute ghost town now. It was packed of zombies earlier, and now there's none. Oh, God, he's thirsty. Uh, we're going to have to sort that out. There's no zombies around me, is there? No, we're going to have to give him his water. Tell you what, I'm, I'm probably not going to pull this group back. I'm probably just going to shotgun these ones to death out here, you know? Might as well. Why not, huh? Why the hell not? There's no point in putting them all back. There's only a small group. Right until they get in nice and sight. And there we go. There we go. Uh -oh. Let's have a little walk away. Turn around and shoot some more. There we go. Nice. Nice and easy. Reload. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. This is so good. We've got no choice but to shoot them. Like, there's so many bloody zombies around this area. Shooting them is the only way we can do this. Alright. Let's go melee on this bird. You look a mess, love. You look like you've seen better days. All right, let's get the old shot out on these ones. One more shot. Is she not going to get in the range? No, she's just going to... Oh, you made me waste the... Oh, I'm out of ammo anyway. Uh, reload. Ah. I mean, this isn't the battle of a lifetime, but it's a battle nonetheless, right? No. All right, you know what? Let me ask you a question. <laughs> uh, there. Only a few of them. We've had worse. We can handle these. Just backpedal into the base. Oh. Actually, let's just 
I, like, I don't like zooming in too far. I can't see what's going on behind me. I don't want to be snuck up on by zombies, you know? I might have left one or two behind. That would suck if I had. No, I didn't get bit. I'm keeping an eye on that. There we go. What, is he drowsy? Yeah, he's drowsy. He's all right. He can take it. He can take it. Plus, we've got a shotgun. We'll just use that. How many rounds we got left with that bad boy? We've got six rounds. We didn't finish reloading. Let's finish reloading. Let's see if we can round up some more zombies. To be fair, it looks kind of clear. Like I feel like we have pulled all of them up into the burger place. It's, they get the odd straggler. We still need to be careful. But the majority of it seems clear. I mean, we're going to have to go through all this and loot as much as we can. There's bound to be, obviously, some zombies around. And there's got to be some good loot around here. I did see one stroll off over here a little bit. But it doesn't matter if they follow me home. If... Oh, aha! I see one. And uh, there's one up there by that tent as well. All right, let's have a bit of this one. And this little axe is quite a, quite a bloody tool. I know that. Oof. Yeah, there's one up there. I'm not going to bother go get her. If I had a gun, I would have just shot her, but I don't. Well, I do. It's a shotty, though, and it's not going to reach. What's going on in here? Anybody in it? No, the place is empty, right? We're going to see if we can get some food. Maybe take it back home with us. Man, this is clear. I feel like we could probably... I mean, there's some down there, but... Screw them, right? We're going to loot this building here. All right, it was locked. <laughs> I just had to break in. But there's still no zombies coming around, which is good. Let's get in. See what we got, what we got, what we got. We can take all the food we can with me. Oh, man. Oil. Uh, it's going to make me miserable as hell, but I'm going to take it because I feel like he probably needs it. What's there? Ketchup. I mean, that's it's going to make him miserable as well, but... No, that weren't real. Oh, everything in the fridge and the freezer is going to be done in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all done. No pickles. Oh, man. I don't want to eat the ketchup, but I feel like caning up a couple of them. And then... And then... Uh, oh, I thought a zombie was coming. Caning up a couple of them. And then reading one of those red books. Could sort him out for his sadness. I'm going to just get ready. That was our tired. We're a bit tired. We can probably head down the road a bit more and then bring some more zombies back with us. We're out here anyway, right? Yeah, to be honest, this area is quite clear. There's like two zombies, three zombies following me. I've been running around screaming for the past 10 minutes. Um, nothing, literally no zombies at all anywhere to be seen. Well, I mean, they're all here on the floor. There they are. Found them all. <laughs> oh, God, that worked so well. It worked so well. Oh, I wonder how many more zombies I can bring, but I kind of want to get in a car and drive up there. And bib in my horn, you know? Oh, here he goes, falling over. If I can get in a car, drive up there, bib me horn, and encourage all the other zombies to come down and see me, as much as I'd love to do that, I don't think I'm allowed, because I said I was going to walk everywhere, so getting in a car is kind of cheaty, right? I mean, building an impenetrable barrier so the zombies can't get in is kind of cheaty, but you know what I mean. Right, I mean... I feel like we should probably head back to some sort of tent and uh, have a rest. Uh, chill out until the morning time. He is wrecked. Been an exciting day. Right. I have just eaten not one, but two bottles of ketchup and a whole bottle of oil. He is extremely depressed now. Uh, and I've used my red book already. There's not much else I can do. I'm afraid. I've got to try and get him to put weight on. He's weighs like 73 kilos. And the only way I can do it is by eating all that horrible stuff. It's just got to be done. Oh, God. The voices are back. I'm trying to sleep. He's sleeping all night, which is good. Jesus Christ, he slept for ages. And he, he's, he's, uh, he's still severely depressed. Uh, I feel like... Probably going to have to walk back home because... Oh, that's where all our good books are. 
The zombie killing's gonna have to wait, I think. Until then. I've got the whisperings of this crazy woman in my ear. It's really creepy. Well, we managed to get that under control. Just feeling a little sad now. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave my bomb gear here because it's it's heavy and I, I don't want to carry it around with me everywhere. I'm going to come back for it when I move on. I wish that voice had just sort off. This is uh, freaking me out a little bit. Where's my bomb gear? Oh, there it is. I'm going to leave that here. It is damn heavy. Ditch that there. Right, that should be all right. I feel like we should be okay. Uh, I need to take a comic with me because I've read them all. Because I, I ate all that crap, didn't I? So, he didn't take too kindly to it. Right. Let's head back out. Let's get a drink. Fill up our water. And then get back out. We've got three water dispensers now, by the way. I found another one. Uh, I can't even remember where I found it. Oh, in one of those military housing. I carried it home with me. Gonna head back out now. It's quicker this way without that armor. Plus, I can't loot run. I'm going to loot the whole area up there. There we are. We're going to raid the first camp. Let's see what's in this area here. Probably nothing. I mean, there's only a couple of zombies here. Mr. Officer, how's it going? Not too well. I oh, know. You've seen better days, mate. There we go. Thank you for your service, Mr. Police Officer Man. Or lady. It's a weird angle. I can't quite see. I apologise. No, I don't expect the car. I want to get in it. What have we got? Oh, taxi key. Oh, nice. Oh, we have a taxi. Hmm. I did say we were going to walk. Technically, we're at Louisville. That's all crap. Is there any fuel in this bad boy? Maybe we can get generator up and running. I don't know. I'd like to just use it to um, basically see load up gear you know I don't want to use it to get around us oh, gas tank zero damn it I don't want to use it to get around get around I was just gonna maybe use it to load up gear and bring it back you can't loot these tents no can you oh you can attack you can attack the tent tarps tent pegs oh that weren't worth it tent pegs pegs that's the one Jesus all right, let's keep exploring and let's do what we can find in this little horrible camp. Quite disappointed with this little camp area, to be honest. There's not much in the ways of food around here. It's all quite empty. It's all just kind of junk, to be fair. I mean, even the trailer's empty. The majority of the cars are empty. I've got a key for one of them. There's no fuel, but I said I weren't going to drive anyway, so we're walking. Hmm, I might go further up the road see what other zombies we can round up now that we're here and uh, just round up a big group and burn them down oh, oh he's not real oh look oh leather gloves yes we got some new gloves yes finally they're wrecked get rid of that crap got a map though let's have a little read yeah i think we already knew that anyway oh i've got an empty gas can but i can't find it oh we've got the the van key. Well, we'll take that. Nice. But the van's got a bit of fuel in it. Not much. But at least we know it's there. At least. Maybe we can use it. Grab a generator or something at some point. Right. Oh, there's loads of zombies up here. Here we go. Let's round up loads more. And we'll burn them down with the old shotty. There we go. Nothing like a cut of shotgun shells into some zombies to wake up all the other zombies. Here we go. Now we're going to have some fun. Ah, how many rounds have I got? I've got 28 and I've got 6 in the in it already and I've got 1 loaded. So, 7. Plus the 28 I've got sitting in my pocket. Let's see if we can get some more down here. I can't remember how far up the road we made. Also, we made it as far as the radio shack. Well, at least we made it this far. I've got some zombies behind me. Not massive amounts. I mean, it's, it's a flow horde. It's getting there. It's getting there. We've all got to start somewhere, haven't we? So, you know, we'll get the rest. Hopefully. And walk home with them, maybe or not. We'll just kill them here. I don't know. 
All right, this place is going to be rammed with zombies. I can hear them. Look at them. There's loads all over the place. Around these up, along with the ones that are behind me. Burn them all down. And go into pizza world. A nice celebratory pizza. Not that they're all going to be anything nice to eat in there. It's all going to be rotten, in it? Do we have a little peek? Do we have a little peek at the horde? Holy crap. All right. Uh... I need a... I can do this. I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Aim. And... Shoot. God damn it. I missed like 90% of them. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. We got this. We, we took care of them before. And if we fell, we can just walk back home again. And go from there. At least this way, we're rounding up more zombies as we go. Ah... Ah! Some of them are quite close. He's having a friggin' nervous breakdown here. There we go. Let's get all these zombies. There we go. All we've got to do is just literally just stay ahead of them. We'll be able to walk them back home. It shouldn't be an issue at all. Oh, this is so much fun. So much fun. Why have I not played with a shotgun before? This is insane. All right, let's just keep going. Oh, I pushed the wrong button. The old bull guy almost had me. If I'm going to go out, I don't want to go out by old bald man. That would be horrible. Imagine that gumming on you. Ugh. Come on, guys. Still trying to round them up. I feel like I've lost a few. I'm going to go back and see if I can get them. Although I'm well aware that he's tired. If I get exhausted, then... I'm basically going to have an issue. Oh no, those crawlers I think can take out the compost. So I'm not entirely sure. I can't remember. Here we go. Lead them back into the base. Ah, get ready for more bodies. I'm almost out of shotgun showers anyway. I've got like one left, two left, something like that. Come on, mate. Hop over. Don't hurt yourself. There we go. Here we go. Ah, and here we go. Murder again. Ah, damn it. Oh, stay right there, guys. I'll be right back. I'm just going to get some more shells. Or my other gun. Oh, yeah. I'll lob this one on the floor. Well, his aim's definitely got better. What is his skill for his aim at the moment? His skill for his aim is... Where is it? There it is. Oh, three. Not bad. He's, he's definitely got better with his aiming. I'll say it now. He misses, like, three shots in a row, but... Yeah, he's got better. So much better. We've got enough ammo here to take out, like, the whole zombie horde, man. Right? This is no hassle whatsoever. Oh, come on. Yeah, reload. Oh, I put a scope on it. Actually, far better with a scope. Getting that long-range shots now. Oh, man. Flying through this ammo. This gun's going to break at some point, I notice. Don't worry, I've got another three of them. Kind of exposable. Spend... Oh. That not? There we go. Nice. This is going really well. Oh, I've cleared out the area quite a bit. There's a, there's a couple of hundred zombies on the floor, I reckon. There's one in there, but I'm just going to leave her with that door. Just leave her to it, I think. This is going to be rancid at some point. We're going to have to start using the other area to get in and out, to be honest. This isn't going to be uh, the best location to use to and, and exit the base for much longer. And he's knackered anyway. And he's he's hungry and he's thirsty. And it's probably best that he heads home. Have a little rest. How many zombies we killed? 1,147. Good cut of 100 zombies. Not bad. Not bad at all. We've still got plenty of rounds to kill another cut of 100 more. Alright. So we're back home. We've had some water. He needs some food and he's going to go to sleep. I think we've done pretty good, to be honest. We built some contraptions. We led zombies to a kill, kill zone. We've killed 1,147 zombies. Lasted one month and 10 days. Um, We live here. This is where we live at the moment. We need to get... I mean, how far up the road did we get? I, I feel like we got to about here. Oh, wow. It's like outskirts of Louisville, though. Not far. Actually, it probably is Louisville, to be honest. 
So we've got here, like, that's the pizza place. I don't know what this is. I've got no idea what all this is. But we could probably... I might get a car just to drive up there and then get out, murder everybody, and then drive back again. Because it's going to be a pain in the ass having to walk that and then walk back and then walk back up again. And then, you know what I mean. Mind you, we are putting extra zombies out of the trees down here and down here, which is good. Next destination is this. And then we can loot all this crap on the way up. Figure out what this is. This is the military housing. We could probably pull some zombies from there as well. We'll probably get some food out of that. But other than that, we're doing all right. I mean, Louisville is a pretty... Jesus Christ, it's massive. We barely made a dent. We could do with an outpost up here somewhere. It would be nice. But try and transfer all the weapons up there. That'd be amazing. But, you know, it is what it is. We'll get there when we get there. So I'm going to leave this episode here. I feel like we've done quite a bit today. So thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see some more of Dixon Nassie's journey, then subscribe. And if you want to play the Schizophrenia mod yourself, feel free. Link is in the description. And yeah, just click on the link. It'll take you straight there and have a good time. Thanks for coming, guys. Bye.